Oh, it's just uh, something. <clears throat> so I've decided to um, I mentioned in the first or if I had the second video when I was uh, assembling the head that uh, I decided not to uh, put an LED. Well, I decided I decided again that I will do so. Um, it, uh, so yeah. The thing is, just the wires are probably just going to be hanging from the back of the figure. Um, I won't have an individual um, LED where it could be turned on by magnets. Um, that would just because the batteries won't be, last as long. Of all, so so what's going to happen is I'm, it'll be powered by two options. Here. I've given myself it'll be powered by two AA 1.5 batteries. Because these um, these LEDs are uh, three volts, so and the other option I'm give, that I given myself is um, using a um, this one here wall plug. So those are my two options. Most likely, if this this would be an option where I've actually gotten a display for the figure and uh, anyway either way it's gonna work so here we go I've already hooked it up very simple so okay there you go now ideally this would have been great if I had um, already in sort of glued this thing in the head went out prior to um, completely installing the uh, parts of the of, of the head, but um, I'm just gonna, most likely uh, what I'm I'm planning to do is probably put two of these or three to light up the, to light up the whole head. I'm just gonna tape it in. So since I can't exactly glue it to the parts of the eyes, um, I'm just gonna. Put in a bunch of them because uh, I've been reading up on it, and I can put at least one to fifty <laughs> of these LEDs on connected to this, and it'll light it up. It'll light it all up. So probably putting maybe I'm thinking about me, but most likely two in total. We'll see. I'm gonna make, I'll be experimenting to see how far it it gets. Um, yeah, so. So that's the plan for this one here. So, yep. All right, that's it for now. Okay, I'm just following up on this thing. I've just uh, roughly stuck in the, the LED in there. And um, there's a switch. Can you see the switch? Oh, here we go. It seems that one would will suffice. Um, we'll see. Yeah, like I said, I'm probably thinking of putting another one in there. It's gonna be a lot of light bleeding. It looks like. We'll see how it looks. Like. But I honestly, I don't care. <laughs> um, as long as it, the lights are, it's lit up. But I'll, I'll see if I can stick in another one there. See if I could. Brighten up just a bit, but it actually looks pretty good with just one LED. These suckers are pretty bright, so yeah, it's looking good. I only one regret is that I won't be able to put uh, an LED behind that matrix thing. It, it was possible, but um, deconstructing that thing was pretty hard. Um, so, anyway, um, yeah, that's, uh, I think that's pretty good. Okay. Okay, it's just testing the wiring. Um, I don't 
There's a lot of bleeding in the back. Um, only because of parts, it's not uh, connecting well. So I um, have to see to that and see what's going on with that. But um, I pretty much have an idea of how I'm going to wear this thing up. Uh, so, yeah, it looks pretty good. Happy with it. It's just the bleeding part that's... Uh, it was always... At the beginning, though, it didn't really fit together nicely, but... Oh, well. But that's it, yeah. Okay, that's... Uh, hopefully... I can pull this off once everything's all said and done. Alright, that's it. Thanks.